Hi, my name is Jim. I'm from S Rock Ready Mix. Today we're going to go over self consolidating concrete. We're going to follow the sampling procedures according to ACI and ASTM as we normally would for any concrete. And we're going to show you the spread test. This is simply the wetness of the concrete or, as, or what we refer to as the slump. This is going to be in accordance with ASTM 1611. We're going to go over the tools that you'll need. You'll need a simple slump cone as you've always used in the past, a scoop. You'll need a board to measure the spread, and you'll need a tape measure uh, that will operate in the neighborhood of 24 to 30 inches. Next step is we're taking a standard slump cone. We're going to invert the slump cone upside down to the V shape. We're going to fill it in one complete fill. No rotting is necessary. At that point, my assistant has it secured and will then lift it very slowly, and this will create the spread. Okay, I've consolidated, remixed and consolidated my sample, and I'm simply going to fill the cone with no rotting. The next thing we'll do is we're simply going to strike off the top of the slump cone with any excess and then we're going to clean the spread board off right before we lift the cone. Okay, now my assistant's going to lift the slump cone in one motion three to five seconds. I'm going to take the spread from the largest apparent diameter and then at 90 degrees to that. I'll average the two and the average of those two numbers will be our spread. I'm at 22 inches. I'm at 23 inches. The average spread would be 22 and one half inch. 